Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of 15 Minute Builds. And in today's episode, we are going to be building this little jungle hut, uh, which I think is pretty cool. Now, this build, it's actually super, super easy. It's very, very simplistic. Um, but this build is more about creating atmosphere than it is about the build itself. So you notice as you come in this path, it's very, very overgrown. It's almost claustrophobic with all the vegetation. And then you go inside and you've got lots of interior space to work with. Um, but that's pretty much it. Maybe you'll learn something about atmosphere. Also, I should probably mention all the materials in this build can be found in a jungle biome. So if you do spawn in a jungle, uh, this could be a house for you to build. Uh, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get right to building. I'm going to put 15 minutes on the clock starting right now. So the first thing that we're going to want to do is lay out a bit of a shape. So let's go uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then we'll go 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 1, 2, 3, just like that. Then we'll take jungle logs and place them like so, all right? Now, we're going to take all of that up to a total height of 4. So we'll do this. And we're just going to do that all the way around the build. Come on now. There we go. And actually, I think... Yeah, I can... There we go. That's a little easier. There we go. And then we'll do the same with the jungle logs as well. If I can. There we go. And like that. Okay, so there's that part. Now, next, we're going to grab some jungle wood slabs. And around this edge, we're going to line this with jungle wood slabs, just like this. So that'll kind of stick out and give us just a little bit of an overhang here, which is good. And we'll go all the way around like so. There we go. And then we're also going to need some jungle planks. So next layer, we're going to do essentially the same thing. We're just going to use jungle wood planks this time. Just like you see here. And there we go. And then we'll go ahead and take our slabs and put them down in a ring around the edges like this. Because we want this thing to kind of wrap. Oh, not there. There we go. There we go. So we should have a shape essentially like this. There we go. That's better. And then those top bits. We'll go ahead and wrap those around here. So you can see we're kind of creating another circle like that, right? And this is kind of getting us this roof shape that we want. Okay, now these are up at a half slab level, so we can go ahead and just fill this part in with full blocks. And then here we'll do our slabs again like so, and actually we should probably fill these ones in too, and then we'll just go ahead and cap that off. And that gives us this kind of jungle roof shape thing, which works. All right, now this is where our door is going to go, and we're going to have a window here and here and here, and then I'm just going to put down a couple torches so you guys can see. Uh, you can put the lighting wherever you want. Next step, let's go ahead and tear up the floor in here real quick. There we go. We just need to get rid of all of this grass. And like so. And then finally, we'll go ahead and fill that back in with jungle wood planks. This is the kind of stuff that makes me miss world edit. Just... 
filling in large quantities of the same material, I'm pretty sure you guys could figure out how to fill in a floor using one material all by yourself. Anyway, uh, okay, so we got that. Let's take some jungle fences here, and we'll put those in the windows, like so. And then we're just going to start, uh, actually, before we do that, We'll put a jungle door right there. Okay, now we're just gonna randomly take blocks from kind of all over the place, like this, and we're gonna essentially replace all of those blocks with mossy cobble instead. There we go. And it will look something like this when we're all done. There we go. So we get this, we get the nice texture variation there. Now we want to mess this up a little bit. So let's take a couple of these corners. Uh, I actually also need some mossy cobble walls. There we go. And in some of these corners, we'll take some walls. Uh, I also need some cobblestone stairs. And we're just going to kind of mix a few of these in. Uh, we are going to be creating some holes in the walls as we do this. But that's okay. It's fine. It adds, I think it really kind of adds to the build. And we're essentially just giving this impression that the whole thing is really kind of dilapidated and messed up. And uh, I think it's really kind of a cool effect that that creates for us. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, there we go. Let's do that. Let's maybe do another one here, up here. There's no real, like right or wrong way to do this. It's just kind of however you see fit, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Uh, hopefully it does. So let's do maybe that. Here we can put another one. We're just kind of mixing in these shapes. Maybe do something like that. And then up here we could do... Yeah, that's not bad. Okay, there we go. Just mixing in cobble here and there. Let's actually do it that way. We'll put a jungle here, maybe a mossy here, and a regular cobblestone wall there. And then this one, maybe I'll make a... Yeah, there we go. So that now our walls look sufficiently kind of messed up. So now we get to the important part, and that would be the landscaping. So first and foremost, let's grab ourselves some jungle leaves. We'll grab some jungle saplings. Uh, we'll grab some bone meal, and then we'll grab a couple of vines. So this is primarily what we're going to use. So first and foremost, we're just going to go ahead and spam jungle leaves kind of all around the edge of the build. And I'm going to focus primarily on the front of the build uh, for this, but obviously uh, that's pretty much due to the time limit. If you had a bit more time, uh, I would highly encourage you to do this, you know, around the entire build. Uh, and then we're just going to take jungle leaves and we're going to kind of spam them on the roof as well. And we're basically just kind of creating this effect that uh, the place is very overgrown. We'll also do the same with maybe some vines, like so. I think you guys kind of get the idea here. We're just spamming vines and foliage. There we go. Just to kind of give us this very overgrown effect. We'll also take our jungle leaves and bring those down as well. Like they're hanging foliage, which is kind of the look that we want to go for here. Just a little bit at least. Maybe here we bring one down that actually connects all the way? Eh, maybe not. But either way, you guys hopefully are kind of getting the idea. I mean, obviously this would be refined a little bit more if we had more time. I would be a little more, uh, you know, finicky about where the blocks themselves are being placed. But... Given that we're building to a time limit, this is more about the concept than it is about anything else. And as I said, this build is really about kind of creating atmosphere. So now we've got, you know, this very overgrown uh, 
kind of feel to this whole build. You can see it's very, very overgrown like that. Now, what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of take a real simple path. Uh, let's grab a little bit of grass and just kind of do something like that. We'll take some coarse dirt and fill that in like so, just to give us this really kind of dirt path impression. And then all along that path, I'm going to spam more jungle leaves like this. And then we're going to make sure we kind of build some of those up a little bit more. Uh, we want maybe some in the ground as well. Uh, the goal here is to create some kind of height difference uh, as we're going along here. So we're just kind of, wherever we see fit, we're just kind of spamming these around. So we maybe get something kind of like that, maybe one here as well. Then we're going to take bone meal and we're going to bone meal like this entire little thing. And the flowers, we, want the, we don't want the flowers. We want the flowers to go away. Um, those are not what we want. So let's just make sure that these flowers are gone. There we go. Get rid of that one too. I think that's all the flowers. And then we're going to take bone meal and make sure that a lot of these uh, reeds are, or not these reeds, but these uh, bits of grass are high. Uh, more than we normally would. So we'll do something maybe like this. Maybe. <laughs> You know, we're just overgrowing the whole thing. And then we'll take some jungle saplings and plant some jungle trees. Just kind of all around this build. Come on, grow. No, that one's not going to grow. Okay, let's try it here instead. There we go. Maybe one here. Oop. Or just, it really does not like that. There we go. I was going to say, it doesn't like that spot very much. Uh, let's extend this path a little bit. Plant down some more flowers. Or not flowers, but uh, plant down some more of these uh, grass. High to the, the tall grass. We'll do a little bit of that. And maybe another tree, like, right about here. There. That looks pretty good. And then I think we want a tree back here, too. Okay. So, we've kind of got that going. Now, we do want a little bit of lighting in here. Just a little. So, we're just going to take some jungle fences. And we'll just put a jungle fence there with a little torch on top. And we're basically just going to make little tiki torches. And those will go, you know, all the way along the path. Like so, just to kind of light it up a little bit. Uh, maybe one here. There. So we get these kind of very overgrown feel. And I think it looks pretty good. Now, uh, we'll probably want a bone meal back here, too. And we'll just kind of grow some of this grass as well. And maybe a little bit more over here. I mean, I, I basically, we're just trying to really give this, this feeling of overgrowth and vegetation that is just, you know, swamped. <laughs> that it's, it's, a, a, it's a jungle. I mean, that's basically the feel we're going for. Uh, and a lot of this will probably be natural for you if you actually are building in a jungle biome. So that's something to keep in mind as well. But I think that's pretty much the build, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and call this one done at 13 minutes and 21 seconds. So there we have it. Check this out. It's looking good, I think. And there is a lot of interior space. There's a lot of things you could do. Oh, I broke the door. Uh, there's a lot of things you could do with the interior. But really, this one was about atmosphere. And I hope you kind of got some ideas for atmosphere, you know, creating this very overgrown uh, feel. But guys, that is going to do it for me. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.